The couple, who first crossed paths during the Sydney Olympics in the year 2000, continue to embody a deep and enduring love in their public appearances. Their recent series of family photographs not only showcase their profound comfort with each other but also paint a picture of the enchanting royal life they have meticulously crafted together. However, within the esteemed halls of the royal household, whispers of apprehension linger, hinting at the potential for sudden shifts. In particular, Queen Margaret has purportedly shared quiet concerns with Queen Mary, cautioning her about the possibility of King Frederick following in his father's footsteps, potentially evolving into a less desirable figure as he matures. These murmurs carry weight as the late Prince Henrik, Margaret's spouse of half a century until his passing in 2018, was often considered a disruptive force, discontent with his standing and deemed tiresome by many Danes. Before we proceed, please like this video and subscribe to our channel. King Henrik's disgruntlement with his role manifested in various ways over the years. As he aged, he grew increasingly unsupportive of his wife, occasionally opting for revelry without her presence, leaving Margaret to attend royal affairs and meetings alone. Despite the Queen's apparent tolerance of his actions, Henrik's behavior at times ventured into solitude, with prolonged periods spent away from the palace. Known for his indulgence in life aboard the Danish royal yacht, HDMS Danibrog, Henrik found solace in the company of friends, relishing wine and convivial meals. His absences extended beyond Denmark, with frequent retreats to his vineyard in France, a place where he felt a sense of belonging. The prince's discontent reached a crescendo in 2002 when he made global headlines by retreating to his chateau in reflection, citing a lack of respect in Denmark. Henrik's grievances were further exacerbated when he felt sidelined during significant events, including being overlooked for the honor of introducing the Queen at a New Year's Eve ceremony, a duty bestowed upon Crown Prince Frederick instead. His bitterness and sense of indignation were palpable as he lamented feeling marginalized, humiliated, and perpetually frustrated. In 2015, Henrik's absence from Queen Margaret's 275th birthday celebration due to illness underscored the strains within their relationship. Contrasting their circumstances with those of Queen Margaret and the late Prince Henrik, King Frederick and Queen Mary grapple with their own set of challenges and speculations. While King Frederick stands as the male heir to the throne, a position that commands respect and responsibility, Queen Mary and her husband have been the subject of persistent rumors hinting at a potential rift in recent years. These whispers stem from Fred's past reputation as a charismatic figure and playboy prince, fueling doubts about his readiness to embrace the full weight of royal duties as his ascension to the throne approaches. The murmurs swirling around the couple are especially disconcerting, drawing parallels to historical narratives that suggest a pattern of nocturnal separations. Amidst these swirling rumors, sources suggest that Margaret harbors concerns about a recurring pattern of marital strain. The specter of an invisible husband, a term alluding to the challenges Margaret faced during her reign, looms large. Since assuming the role of official regent in 2019, Queen Mary has found herself frequently navigating the complexities of royal duties and familial responsibilities, often at the expense of a traditional marital bond. Reports hint at nights spent apart due to conflicting priorities, with suggestions of a potential retreat to a nearby bachelor pad by one of the partners during moments of discord.